Hello all those awesome people out there, my name is Akiro and welcome back to this let's play of Life is Strange Where we will see if we can get... Courtney! That was the person I was looking for! Hey Courtney, how are you? Uh, what is Max Caulfield doing at a Vortex Club party? <laughs> it really must be the end of the world, <laughs> get it? But seriously, like, what do you want? I didn't want to be alone tonight after this week, so... I thought it'd be nice to hang out in the VIP section. Yes, it is very nice. If you're in the Vortex Club, which you're not and will never be. So, excuse me. Okay. Great plan, Max. Time to find another way into the VIP. Don't stress, Courtney. I'm still getting into the VIP section. <sighs> One way or another. Do I speak to you? I speak to you. Um, it's just something over here. Um, probably not. This is. Time before I push that thing down. There we go. I was not cheating at all. Enter. Nathan is the Vortex Club, so his ass has to be here tonight. Victoria is next on Nathan's hit list. Should I warn her? Yeah. yeah. Uh, did you hear? Sorry, I'm Max. Vortex to... Club oh, members only. Sorry. Real I'm on the guest list. Nice. I'm taking you off. Go fuck yourself, you Victoria. I don't have time for this bullshit. Real cute, Max. And after I apologized to you the other day. Do you even have a clue what's going on at Blackwell? Kate Marsh killed herself in front of you and me and everybody here. That's not my fault, Max. Don't you even try to blame me. I don't blame you, Victoria, but you know Kate had a church group and that she didn't party. So why did you send out that video? Oh, God. I swear we weren't even going to do it. Then we had some wine and got stupid. It's more than stupid. It's mean. Hateful. Kate never did anything to you. And that didn't stop you from taking one last video of her on the roof. I deleted that from my phone. Max, I saw Kate Marsh die. I swear it didn't feel real to me. I kept thinking, did I cause this? Did I? I felt like shit ever since. I believe you, Victoria, but I don't understand you. That makes both of us, Max. I always feel like I have to overcompensate. For what? I have no clue. I'm only here to become a photographer, not president. You have talent, Victoria. You don't have to push people out of your way. You don't understand. My parents own a gallery. I know how this art game has to be played. It's brutal. No, it's, it's art. You don't have to play their way. Mr. Jefferson doesn't talk that way, and, and he's famous. On point, Max. Thanks for admitting again that I have some talent. Not that I think I always do. I don't either, but that's the choice you make. Hard to believe, but I don't always make the best choices. Do you think it's like fake we're not supposed to be friends? Mm 
Um. Why the hell not? We're both into art and photography. We're both kind of weird and pretentious. If we hung out with our attitude, we'd get along fine. I almost asked you to hang out. You said my photos were Abaddon-esque. Then I remembered who I was. You should have asked me. It would have been cool to compare photo notes. Maybe we're too much alike. You might be right. Well, Max Caulfield, there's still time for you to get in the Vortex Club. I actually hope so, Victoria. Why do you say it like that? Um... This one. Victoria, listen to me. Your life is in serious danger. I know Nathan is your friend, but he is truly unstable and dangerous. He did drug Kate at that party so he could take her something dark. What? Nice try, Max. But I don't believe you. And why would he do that? That I don't know yet. But it was enough to make Kate want to die. And I think you're next. Max, that is crazy. Nathan is like one of my best friends. Yes, he takes serious meds, but that's not his fault. His family treats him like a total freak just because he has little meltdowns. They're not little anymore. They're deadly. I, I don't care if you hate me or not. You have to believe me. You could have been a major bitch to me when I got hit with that paint, and I deserved it. Max, I don't hate you. I actually think you're one of the coolest people at Blackwell. Weird, Thank you. but cool. You just don't know it yet. Maybe I'm jealous because you don't give a shit what anybody thinks, and I do. To be honest, Nathan has been freaking me out lately. He's not here, and I haven't seen him. Just make sure you stay away from him. And stick close to your friends tonight, okay? I let you boss me around this one time. And I have other people I can go to for protection. Thanks for telling me this, Max. If what you said is true, then you be careful too. I've got my own protection. Um, text me if you need anything. I will. Thanks, Victoria. Au revoir. I did something good, I think. I hope. Okay. Maybe there's hope yet for Victoria and me. Hopefully. Chloe, Nathan isn't here. Nobody has seen him tonight. He's definitely not upstairs or in the lockers. Damn. Maybe he's hiding in his dorm. Then let's bail. Nathan can't hide anymore. So, you made it. Oh, uh, hey, Mr. Jefferson. Uh, are you both okay? You look like you're on a, a mission. Oh, uh, I was just... Looking for Nathan. Uh-huh. I didn't know you were pals with him. I haven't seen him since this afternoon. He he seemed pretty upset. I think he's still quite upset over the uh the whole Kate situation. Yeah, that makes sense. Let's talk later, Max. I have to announce the winner of the contest. I do wish you would have entered. You have to build up that resume and portfolio, but I know you will. Thanks. I hope so. Okay, excuse me. I'm almost gone. Let's get the hell out of here, Max. He sounded kind of drunk. <laughs> okay, okay, everybody calm down. Thank you. Thank you. I, I appreciate it. I, I don't want to get in the way of the party, but it's time to announce the winner of the Everyday Heroes Contest. Before I do, I want to thank everybody who entered their photograph and everybody who thought about entering. Now this is the most important step in being an artist. Sharing your work with the world. All of you represent Blackwell Academy and everything our school stands for. As far as I'm concerned, you're all everyday heroes. The envelope, please. And the winner is... Oh my, what a shocker. Victoria Chase. Thank you so much, Mr. Jefferson. 
It was your incredible photography that brought me to Blackwell, and I hope I can live up to your name and fame. I also want to thank all the students for being so dedicated in their pursuit. And I'd like to dedicate this prize to the memory of Kate Marsh. She was the real everyday hero of Blackwell. Thank you. You suck, Victoria. Gee, thanks. Victoria won. Big surprise. I can't believe she blackmailed Jefferson. Yes, I can. <laughs> Who fucking cares? Rachel is still dead, and I want Nathan's punk ass now. Me too. Let's go check out the dormitories. Okay. Nathan just texted me. He says there won't be any evidence left after he's done. Shit. We have to go to the junkyard right now. Why are there two moons? And... There's something really wrong here. Just get ready to use your rewind fast if Nathan tries to jump us. Can I move, please? Hey. Right. There we go. There we are. Don't go in front of me like that. Rachel, I will get your revenge. I swear. What was that? A bird. I hope. It's so creepy out here. Uh, yeah, it's middle of the night, and for some reason, I'm the only one who uses the light. God, I want to fucking kill that little psycho. Hey, I can't. Focus if you're yelling. Please. Max, please hurry. <sighs> I'm trying. Oh god, Max, look. She's still there. Don't look, Chloe. Oh no. Is. Chloe! Look out! What the fuck? What? What the hell? Let's see. Uh, I accept a close request to stop one from being Nathan. No one got hurt. Victoria, believe your warning. Okay. Um, next. I have a feeling that my plant is dead. <laughs> or oh, what it is. I have no idea actually. Uh, you didn't disturb the bird nest. No, I put it back. Um. You got David's files in another way. Yep, I couldn't remember the code. Uh, Kate didn't help you. 
Of course he's dead. He didn't motivate David to attend the Vortex Club party. Daniel. Oh. <laughs> he didn't leave a message on Ron's state. Nope. You didn't figure out Nathan's pin code. Nope. You held and Lisa, of course I did. Okay, so but I still did bad. I think. Okay. So now we're just waiting for episode 5 to come out. Well, this story has taken a turn I don't particularly like. So, yeah. So, um. Yeah, I will be back when the I will play this game when episode five come out, and then we will see the conclusion of all this. So I hope you enjoyed this episode. You can give it a thumb up if you did. You can hit me up on Facebook, Twitter, or write a comment down below. You can subscribe for more awesome videos, and I hope I will see you all the next time. So hope you all will have an awesome day. So until next time, farewell. <laughs>